The secrets of the human brain are the focus of one of Europe's largest research projects. More than 130 institutes are taking part in building a detailed computer model of the human brain. Their aim is to get an unprecedented insight into the mysterious processes of our brain and improve the diagnosis of brain disorders and diseases such as Alzheimer's, Parkinson's and the Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder. One of the institutions working on mapping the brain is the Karolinska Institute in Sweden. Within the EU-funded project Select and Act, they study the striatum, a special part of the forebrain which controls our motor behaviour. Information gained about this brain map is based on experiments with rodents and lamprey. The fish belong to the first vertebrates which emerged about 500 million years ago. The scientists are examining in detail their neuronal circuits and structure. Their simple brain seems to show a model of how our brain works. Sten Grillner coordinates the project. The lamprey has in detail the same structure in terms of nerve cells, their membrane properties, the inhibition, the connectivity, the transmitters, which is a novel finding within this project. The results from Sweden will also contribute to the Human Brain Project, coordinated in Lausanne, Switzerland. Project initiator Henry Markram is convinced that they're starting to make important discoveries about how our brain is structured and functions. We can start looking for fundamental rules that govern biology. Those are discoveries that are going to happen throughout the course of these 10 years. To realize this ambitious aim, supercomputers a hundred times more powerful than any existing today will be needed. Once these supercomputers are available, it might be possible to create a realistic simulation of the human brain. The cost of the project is estimated at 1.2 billion euros, but this money could be well spent, as currently one-third of the total healthcare cost in Europe and North America is allocated to brain diseases. A better diagnosis and possible treatment could mark a milestone in modern medicine and also reduce the costs of healthcare in the long run.